hello connexit family welcome to connexit training videos today in this video i'll be showing you how you can actually send and whatsapp messages for your customers whenever there is a whenever they place an order on your woocommerce store so basically on your commerce e-commerce store so whenever they place an you know order customer place an order you can send them a whatsapp message so i will show you how you can do that so using whatsapp cloud api so basically it's an official whatsapp uh, cloud api from uh, facebook meta team itself so we'll be showing you how you can do that using a workflow automation tool called connexit so let's build a workflow so i'll show you how to do that so using connexit so before you creating a workflow you make sure you have to authorize your app that is whatsapp cloud api inside connexit by giving all these credentials so let's go ahead and search for whatsapp cloud api yes you have to click on the app click on add account it will ask you for token phone number id and whatsapp business account id to generate all this i had actually created and complete end-to-end -end setup video i will add that same video in the description below so please do watch that entire video how you can actually create an whatsapp cloud api account and also to set up a permanent access token so that something look like account look like this so where you will be having a permanent access token so something like this you can copy that and go ahead and paste it over here and the phone number id so basically when you go here you will get that phone number id so when you add your phone number so i had already shown you how to add that phone number as well in the previous video so just copy and paste it and whatsapp business account id so that will be there here you have to copy that and paste it here and then click on sn continue so once you did that so it will authorize your whatsapp cloud account inside connexit so now we are ready to build our workflow by clicking on create connect so let's go ahead and click on create connect let's name our connects as whatsapp order notification on whatsapp so i'm going to send whenever there is a new order on WooCommerce store so I'll be sending a notification on WhatsApp so I just named my connects so now let's search for WooCommerce just drag and drop the app and select the trigger as order created so whenever there is a new order so let's go and just select the trigger and then click on copy and go to your woocommerce store so that is your wordpress site and then go to woocommerce click on settings click on the advanced tab to place your webbook url which you copied from connexit click on webbooks tab here and then click on add webbook it will ask you for the webbook name you can give any random name so and make sure you set the status as active and also select the topic as order created so just select the trigger and place your delivery url which you copied from connexit and leave this secret as empty and the api version as same thing can click on save webbook so this will going to save your webbook and it completes the process of you know adding a webbook url inside woocommerce store so now that we are done with this so now let's go to connexit and click on capture webbook response this will enable connexit to capture the response from the, your woocommerce store so whenever there is a new order created so now let's go to our store so our store look like this let us place an order for any product basically so you know i will select this particular product let's go to this product and click on proceed to checkout and then yes i will going to add the name as alisha sean and then company name is yes, let me leave everything like this and then i'll select as place cash on delivery and i will just place order basically 
uh, I placed an order for Alisha John. Yes, order placement is done. So the same will be received over here in WooCommerce in ConnectSeed. So it will take some time to receive an order details. Let's wait for it. Yes, guys, so we received our order. You can see that. So we got an order details from WooCommerce and it will be there in the billing session. So we have the name and the details inside the billing tab. So just click on that. So you can see that it says Alicia email and also the name of Alicia. So everything, all the details we are having, we have the phone number, we have the name and we have the email ID. So let's, this is enough. So now let's send an WhatsApp message. So basically it's a template message. So our WhatsApp uh, template message looks something like this. So I already shown how to create this template message also in the previous video, which I added in the description. So make sure you go there. Uh, just very simple so you have to click on create message template and when you go there it will ask which type of message you are selecting so for example if it is a payment update so just select as payment update if it is shipping you can select as shipping and you just say that as payment update and select the language of your which language you want to send the WhatsApp message for, you can select that language and then click on continue. So when you click on continue, so this will ask you for header, body and the footer and the buttons. So CTS basically. So I already created one. So I had shown you how to do that as well. So just it will look like this. So header I selected as a media where I'm adding a document and here you can see that preview looks like this so it says dear john thank you for purchasing the product name and also we value your feedback so basically it sends the footer as sent via connects it and we have a cta to visit our website that is share feedback and here you can see that in the body i just getting a name so that is second variable that is true and also i'm just giving the first variable as a product name so let's do that. So just go here to connect it and drag and drop WhatsApp. Yes, we did that. And now let us select our WhatsApp Cloud API account and select the action as send template message because we are sending template message and always it could it makes your score good. And it asks you for sending, selecting a template. I'm just selecting my payment template and selecting a language. And it asks me for the two ID. So which is the customer number. So I just add the customer number. And it asks me for PDF document. Basically, you know, you can send any document like your invoice or, you know, your ebook or your company profile. So I'm going to send a company, real estate company profile brochure over here. So you can do anything. So I just added the real estate brochure and then say that as real estate. So this particular name will be displayed on WhatsApp. So make sure you can select the right one and you have to add a name. So this is my name is the field number two. So I added the name and also I have to add the product name as well so let me search for the product name i'll just add the product name as demo as i already know that so now let's go ahead and click on test and review so this will basically send an whatsapp message inside whatsapp so let's go Yes, it successfully sent. Yes, guys, you can see that there is a message received. Yes, it says that as real estate brochure, you can see that that's the name we had given for our PDF file name. And you have an option to download that. And it says, dear Alisha, thank you for purchasing our product name. And we value your feedback with your experience. And you can share your feedback. 
so let's we are done with our you know purchase so let's go ahead and, and publish our connects so let's publish our connects yes our connects published successfully guys so now let's test this connect so basically so i'll go ahead and place my order again so i'll go to my shop and this time i just go and click on demo and add cart so let's go to view cart and proceed to checkout so i'm gonna change just the name as rakesh just for your reference and view that as elsa same thing and click on place order so basically i just placed my order yes guys so my order is placed successfully and it will take some time to receive an whatsapp message so let's go to whatsapp here so it will take some time basically couple of minutes yes guys so we received an whatsapp message you can see that so it says dear rakesh thank you for purchasing the product name and we value your feedback and it says the footer so you can use it for sending and your branding messages over here in the footer and also the cta where you can redirect your customers to your respective sites hope you guys like this sending notification for all your whatsapp uh, sorry woocommerce orders if you have any questions on this particular integration guys do drop me on the comment section below thanks for watching this video guys have a great day